Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, and welcome to the Charging, Volume 11, for our professional learning meeting on September 26th. Before we specifically get into the Charging, we want everyone to be aware we have a new feature in the main office. Uh, this inspiration board is, is located in the hallway between student services and the main business office. Uh, it's a place where uh, quotes, questions uh, will be posted from time to time. Uh, when you're in the office, come on down. Uh, might be a question for you to answer, uh, put a response, or an, a spot to share an appreciation uh, or share something that's uh, an inspirational quote that you've heard that you want others to see. So come check it out. Okay, as we always do, we'll start with the learning targets. Our learning targets here uh, for Wednesday are on the screen. We want to continue and connect the work that we have been doing for the last over a year um, of our backward design and deconstruction of standards that we started um, during our late start, as well as our work with career and life skills, and, and try to connect that to some of the other work that we have going on, uh, specifically our SLO and PPG work. So just a reminder of the things that we have been doing uh, since last year, we've been talking about the backward design process. That's three stages of uh, curricular planning, starting with the desired results, working our way back from there to identify how we will assess it, and then planning the specific learning experiences or the instruction. At our late start, we talked about uh, when you start with desired results, it's important to be able to break down uh, or deconstruct that standard because the only way we'll get from a desired result or even a, a curricular standard down into daily learning objectives or instructional uh, approaches, we have to be able to know what specifically we want the students to be able to do or know uh, based on that work. So the process of deconstruction. And then we talked about at our late start, uh, the career and life skills standard. So those are some of the things that we've been working on. Just want to ground that first um, as to introducing what we're going to do for Wednesday. So specifically, what we're going to try to do is align some of that work with um, the work that uh, we're doing with our SLO and PPG. So um, the same processes to backward plan or backward design or deconstruct apply directly to our setting of our SLO and PPG. Uh, the same process should go on when we set these goals. So we want to try to give people choice uh, for Wednesday. So um, one option for you to do on Wednesday during the staff uh, meeting or professional learning time um, is we will have uh, people available in the library if you want to come down and discuss the career and life skills standards, um, do some collaboration around resources that have been posted in the Google Classroom. Um, if you want more work on career and life skills, that's an option you can select. Or um, you can decide that you feel comfortable with that and you want to use the time on Wednesday to work on your SLO and PPG work within your PLCs. You can do that. Um, or you've, you feel good about the career and life skills, you've completed and already submitted uh, your SLO and PPG goals for the year, and you're going to use that time on Wednesday um, to do other professional stuff that you have going on. So we're trying to give you your choice, meet you with where you're at, um, do some differentiation for staff. So we're not going to be gathering as a staff on Wednesday. Um, you have one of these three options to do. And so our uh, organizational component to that or our accountability component to that is, you'll see here on the screen, uh, this is a link to a Google form. So uh, what we'd ask you to do is complete this form, which is going to indicate what option you're going to pick for Wednesday uh, after school. Um, this link, you can either pause the screencast and write it into a web browser, and it'll take you to that Google form, uh, or you can go into our professional learning Google Classroom, and the form will be posted there. We'll ask that all staff individually fill out the form and do that by Wednesday the 26th to indicate which option you're going to choose um, as a professional for our time allotted on Wednesday. Hope this makes sense. Hope this provides you an opportunity to uh, pick where you want to invest your time. Um, thank you for watching and uh, have a great rest of your day.